Hey guys, how's it going? Kyle Dittman here with Bullion RV in Duluth, Minnesota. Today I have for you a 318 BR. It's a hideout from Keystone. It's a 2021 brand new. We're filling up all the empty spots in the lot, so come down, check it out. We'll get you around the outside. We'll take you on the inside. We'll see what you think. All right, standing back here, you can kind of see the whole front side. You got your nice big awning. And this one does come with an outdoor camp kitchen, which is great. Nice big mini fridge in there. Outdoor sink. Some cabinets up top. You got your 110. A nice frying pan section here. Boiled noodles. Fry up the bacon for the burgers. Anything you want to do out here on that guy. It's down below. You can see this little section here. Yellow cap. There's your quick connect for an LP tank. But so you can that's an LP hookup, so you can hook up your grill, your gas grill, get the burgers, steaks, everything going out here as well. Really nice feature. Does have the door that stays up over it, give you a little bit of protection from the sun or the rain if you are outside. You can see that second door that's going to be brought into your bathroom. So when you are out here, you can just sneak right in there. You don't got to track through the whole trailer, which is really nice does come on a dual axle nice smooth ride you got your 110 hookup outside for your TV you got your cable hook up there you got your outdoor speakers with the big nice LED strip under there to light up the campsite at night it's really gonna bring some beautiful light this one does have a six gallon hot water tank on it the beautiful solid steps that come all the way down so you're not bouncing the whole camper around going in and out you're gonna have a lot of people with you so the kids and family you know this one comes with a pet leash so if the dogs are running in and out you know the whole trailer is not bouncing around with that being said it also comes on a four jack system that is on power which is really nice just touch of a button to power down your jack system there which is really really nice Bring it out to the front. Up front is where you got your outdoor storage. Nice pass through here. You can really fit a lot of stuff in there. Now the hideout comes with a three year structural limited warranty from Keystone, which is a nice feature. Up front you got your rock guard. To keep all the chips away does come with two 20 pound LP tanks that's what we're going to fill up for you and then we'll set your interstate battery that's going to be thrown in as well right here is where that's going to live so you'll really be ready to just head right down the road once you pull out of the lot here it does have a power electric jack up front makes it really easy for the quick connect and disconnect it does have a light on it so if you get to the campsite late at night you can still do that this unit does have one slide or it has two slides, excuse me. It has two slides on it, so when you get inside, you're really going to see how much it opens it up. I mean, you got all these big, beautiful windows on it. So that adds a lot of space. It makes it feel open, especially then you get the slides. In between the slides is where you're going to have your 30 amp service, and you got the city water connection right there. Bring you around the back side. Now this one does come with a spare tire for you. Right next to that bumper that's going to hide your sewer hose. Back window. That will be in the bunkhouse area. That's just a really nice area. See that? And you do have a backup camera prep for you as well. All right. get you uh, on the inside like I said you got these really nice solid steps great feature good handle next to the door to really bring you in right to your right is your master bedroom with a queen-size bed you got the hers and hers storage on both sides of the bed and then the bed lifts up and is gonna give you 
nice storage under there. And that green bag, it does have a central vacuum in this unit as well. So that is really nice. Both sides of the bed are gonna have a 110 power. And then they have these little stands here on this side. They call it a laundry chute, so you can drop a laundry basket right through there and get your clothes out. Or you can also put some stuff into your storage unit that you'd like to have quick access to from inside so you don't got to go outside in the nighttime. And the other side does have a nice stand in case you want to put a CPAP machine over there. Big windows in the bedroom. And on the far wall you do have a spot for a TV with the 110 and stuff above it for the hookup. This unit does come ducted with AC, so you can see right there, you have an AC unit in this one. This does have the dual sliding pocket doors, so you can get in and out on either side of the bed. You don't kind of walk around the bed to get to the other side, which is really nice. And then up top, you have more storage, and then your reading light below that. We'll bring it around into the living space, kitchen area. You can see it with I said with that slide, it really opens it up, turns into a nice big open area. You're gonna be bringing a crew with you, so it'll be nice to have this open space here for you. Right up front is where your entertainment system is gonna live. You got a TV mount here with your satellite, your 110, your AM, FM, stereo system, Bluetooth. You got um, HDMI, all that stuff in there. You do have a nice furnace, a fireplace, I should say, up front. So if you got electric power at the campsite, you got free heat right there. Under this is a cool little cubby hole. You can just kick your shoes off, stick them under there. They're out of the way. You're not tripping over them when you walk in. You're not tracking dirt through the whole unit. But if you are tracking dirt, like I said, you got your central vac, which is located right in the main living space. So you don't got to be dragging a hose out of the bedroom. It's just right here for you. Above those, you've got some good storage in the kitchen, some good cabinets. And then below as well is a little bit of storage. Up above, your nice dual sink with the high-rise faucet on it. You do have some more storage that does have lights in it. It's a really nice feature there to light it all up. So you don't got to turn on the main headlights on the top to get in there, the ceiling lights. Got a beautiful three top burner with an oven that does have a light on it as well so you can see what you're cooking in there and the nice little accent lights on the switches here microwave at a good height as well and you got lights and fans on the stove like i said this one's ducted for ac so it's got the ac here and it's got the one big unit in this living space because this will be the most people are. So you can leave it open and cool this area down or you can shut those vents and blast it out through the different ducts that are throughout the space here. This one does come with a few speakers on the inside. So you got one up front and then one in the back of the living space, which is really nice. You got the dinette table, which is actually dropped down into the sleeping area right now. Kind of show you like that and then the bars for it will live under here so it gives you a little bit more space you can kind of stick stuff right in there it's not super easy access but you can leave you know things that you want to take with you that you're not going to use on a day-to-day -day basis but you really are going to need with you that's a great extra storage space for that again here's these big beautiful windows we'll leave one shade down so you can then we'll pop that up Look how much light it lets in, it's just beautiful. This sofa couch here will flow down into a futon bed style. And there is more storage under that one as well, which is really nice. Like I said, they're not going to forget about the whole crew you bring away, so you are going to have a lot of stuff. So this unit really does have a lot of storage and a lot of space for everybody. Nice big electric freezer and refrigerator. 10 cubic foot on this bad boy. Fill that all up with the goodies before you hit the road. Bring you around back. And then you do have another, like a, pan, a big pantry area here. A lot of shelves, deep shelves in there to put a lot of your dry goods in here. 
And it does have an LP alarm as well. In case there's any leaks, you have that. Moving into the bathroom, so you saw the door from the outside. Bring you inside here. Got a nice fan above the tub. Shower, which I said has this really nice deep tub. So if you do have any little ones that need to take a bath, they're all playing in the mud. You can throw them in the tub right here. It's really nice. Little cubby hole for a couple toiletries. Nice foot, push, foot flush porcelain stool here. And like I said, this door brings you right out to the grilling space, to the outdoor kitchen. So if you're out there, you can kind of just sneak right in and not tracking through. Or if the kids are sleeping in the living space, you can kind of pop in there if you're still awake at night, out enjoying the awning in the kitchen area. Move you back into where the kids are gonna live. This is the bunkhouse. This is a great feature. Really brings a lot more sleeping, a lot more privacy to this camper. Back here, you got the sleeping quarters here and a couch down here. And then the top sleeping quarters does fold up if you wanted to, to give you a little more, more of that head space down when you're on the couch. So you don't feel so claustrophobic or you're gonna hit your head when you're getting out. All these bunks do have the teddy bear feel material on them. So they're nice and comfortable. Anybody can cuddle up to that. And a nice big bunk up here. Bunch of receptacles back here too. You got the 110 on the back wall, 110 on the side wall. You got a nice little day bed back here, which does fold up. And this has the assist on it too. So the kids can hop in there. Great toy section. You can bring all their fun toys and keep them entertained. That's a great spot for them. And then right across from the couch, you do have a nice cubby hole with some storage below it. And then you got your 110 and cable hookups above so you can fit a nice TV in there. So when it's time to go to bed, you can turn the cartoons on and really have them wind down. The adults are still playing. Like so this is a great section for them. They do have a window in the back. So during the day, you can open that up and bring that light. And you do have some good wardrobe storage to hang all the kids' coats and everything in here. And then a nice little compartment down there as well. Just a great, great space for them. And this one comes with a pocket door as well. So when you want to close it, it'll block off some of that noise for them to really keep quiet time, quiet time. All right. Just a beautiful unit. Really, really nice. All right, there you have it. My name is Kyle Dittman. I'm here at Bullion RV in Duluth, Minnesota. If you have any questions about this unit or any other unit we carry here, give us a check on our website or call me at 320-290-5834. Happy camping.